hello everyone welcome back to my channel this is your girl Shelly and today I'll be preparing barbie fried pigtails with rice and peas I'll be using some salted pigtails I've went ahead and I've added some water to the bowl with the pigtails I'll be scraping any excess things that is left on these pigtails to this dish with the pigtails and water I'll just add a little vinegar I'll be washing these twice. Guys, I know that I've done a barbie fried pigtail video before, but I just wanted to do this one with the salted pigtail. The first one was with the unsalted pigtails. Now to this pot on the stove with the water, we'll be adding our pigtails. So what we'll be doing here, we'll be boiling the pigtails in order to get rid of some of the excess salt. So we'll allow this to boil for about 10 minutes, drain the water, add fresh water, and then boil again for another 10 minutes. Now that I've scalded this pigtail for the second time, I'll be draining this water. I have added some fresh water to the pot with the pigtails. I'll just allow them to cook until tender. Let's check and see if this pigtail is cooked. Guys, as you can see, these pigtails are cooked. Let's move on to the frying of the pigtails. We have here some all purpose flour. To this flour, we have added some black pepper and a little paprika. We won't be adding any salt or any other powdered seasoning because the pigtail is already salt. Now we'll be flouring our pigtails before adding them to the oil. I have added some oil to this pot. I'll just leave the oil to preheat. Now that the oil has been preheated, we'll be adding our floured pigtails and we'll be frying these in sets of two. While frying, we'll be turning them occasionally. These are fried, we'll be removing them and we'll be adding the next set. We'll be doing the same thing we did with the first ones. We'll be turning them occasionally until fried. Now that these has been fried, we are removing them from the pots. For my sauce, I'm using one can of pineapple juice. And this is the pineapple juice I'm using. You can use any brand of your preference. I'll be using some barbecue sauce.
I'm using some honey. I'll be using some brown sugar. You can add any sugar of your preference. I'll be using a little hot pepper sauce. I'll just add a little of my egg powder coloring. And last but not least, I'll be adding some cornstarch mixed with a little water. And I'm using this just to thicken the sauce. Guys, I wanted to show you when I was pouring the sauce over the pigtails, but my phone battery died right as I was about to do so. But anyway, we have added the sauce. Now we'll be placing this inside the oven for about 20 to 25 minutes. Now guys, this is my barbie fried pigtails. Let's move on to our rice and peas. I have here some kidney beans that I've washed and put to soak in some water overnight. Let's just add this to the pot with the water. To this, I'll be adding some chopped garlic. Now I'll just cover and allow to start boiling. I'm going to go ahead and sink my peas. So I'm adding some room temperature water just to sink the peas or the beans, whatever you call it. Now I'll just cover the pot and allow these to cook until tender. Guys, let's check on our peas to see if they are cooked. As you can see, they are cooked, so now we'll be seasoning our pot. First thing first, I'll be adding my coconut milk. Next, I'll be adding a little extra water. Next, I'll be adding some chopped green onions, some pimentos sprigs of thyme and some chopped garlic and guys if you do not want to chop your scallions you can do it the way you like up next instead of using salt i'm using a little of my larry seasoned salt you can use any seasoning any powdered seasoning of your preference or if you rather to use salt Feel free to use salt instead of the powdered seasoning. I'll be adding a green scotch bunny pepper. I'll also be adding a piece of butter. Now I'll just stir and taste just to make sure that I've added the right amount of ingredients. We'll allow these to boil for about 10 minutes so we can get the flavor from all that's added. Last but not least, we'll be adding our rice. And off camera, I've went ahead and I've washed the rice and I did it twice because we're not cooking any rice that is not washed around here. We're just incorporating everything. Next, just cover and allow to cook, but we'll be checking on it occasionally. Mm -hmm. 
our rice and peas is almost cooked. I'm just removing the pepper and the pieces of thyme. I'll be placing a piece of foil over the pot in order to chop in the steam. Now guys, this is our rice and peas, or as some people would call it, rice and beans. Now here you have it, rice and peas and barbie fried pigtails. Please remember to like, share, comment, and for those who haven't already subscribed, please subscribe to my channel.